American Breast Cancer Society says an estimated one in eight women in the U.S. will develop breast cancer. Kega 9's Madison Thomas sat down with a Tucsona to hear about her battle with cancer and the people who are supporting her along the way. Meet Vicki Bishop, a wife, mom, and cancer fighter. I got a phone call and they said, you, you have breast cancer, and I thought, no. I think I've been, I think I'm still in denial, truthfully. She says cancer runs in her family, but she didn't think it would happen to her. She was diagnosed in late 2019, and because of the COVID-19 pandemic, she had to do most of her cancer treatments alone. I never thought I was a strong person on my own. Um, but it was just something you gotta kind of dig your heels into and you have to do it. While her friends and family couldn't physically be with her in the doctor's office, emotionally, they were still by her side every step of the way. You need to fill yourself with the love, compassion, and um, support from other people. And I am, I'm beyond grateful. And her son showed his support in a way she couldn't have imagined. He had shaved his head and colored it pink. She it put his scalp pink, and I remember just crying, um, thinking, oh my gosh, like, why would somebody do that for me? But he didn't stop there. He got his high school football team involved at one of their games. They all brought me flowers. Each one, as they came down from the um, locker room, they each gave me flowers and gave me a hug. These boys just stepped up and they supported me and they loved me and it was the coolest thing. Bishop has one more surgery scheduled for later this year and is ready to put this behind her. I just want to take a breath and lay down in bed at night and go, thank you, like, thank God I'm done. Reporting from the University of Arizona in Midtown, Madison Thomas, KGA 9.